Hi everyone and welcome back. So, what are we doing? We are off to Kashyyyk in this video. Uh, <coughs> actually, we just finished everything on Zepho and we're, uh, yeah, like the next piece of the journey is to go to, um, Chieftain Tafel, if I remember correctly. Before we get started though, if you guys could leave a like, comment and subscribe, that would be amazing. Alright, let's do it. <coughs> If I don't like, you know, picking our next destination, cough to uh, cough myself to an instincts. early grave. All right, here we go. Must be hard watching all your friends get gunned down. I mean, you know, purged or whatever. Hmm. What? It helps to talk about it, right? No? Yes, it was difficult, but you must hope, not forget. We must remember the mistakes of the past and change things going forward to make sure they never happen again. Sounds like you're not too sure everything is going to work out. I'm not. That's why adaptation is important. Whether it's a course of action or an idea, we all have to be ready to change. Sit down, kid. It's uh, time to clear. land. We're not running that blockade. Oh, only as a last resort. I've rigged the Mantis's transponder to transmit Imperial signals. Hey, Grease. Yeah. Keep your power signature low and act like we belong. Just like Bracca. No sweat. I don't need another set of hands. Just please keep your eye on the scanner. All please. Right. All right. All right. I don't see anything. Preoccupied with something on the ground. We're clear. That doesn't look good. The Empire is devouring Kashyyyk for its natural resources. Monkeys have been enslaved or displaced. No, that was a close one, kid! Aren't you supposed to be watching the monitors? Guerrilla fighters. Wookiees and off-worlders ambushing an Imperial convoy. Walkers approaching their position. Tarful could be with him. Tarful could be anywhere. Like deep in the ground, like we're gonna be if we get caught up in that battle down there. We don't have any other options. And and they'll die without our help. So what's your plan? Sabotage. We we'll use the scrap walkers on Braca. I'll just jack one. <laughs> get a load of the kid. He thinks we're back in a clone wars. Captain, uh, get us near those walkers. Wait, what? Listen. Those walkers double as troop transport, so once you get inside, be careful. I've no freeze grease to work as magic. Hey, do me a favor. Stay alive down there. I'll add it to the plan. Right if you're jumping, you better do it now, kid. You ready for a swim, BD? <laughs> Actually, the swim boost is circled, so I don't know why that's said on that. Um, um, yeah, I think the game could have done with a bit more, like, well, could do with a bit more uh, scenes like this. When you're sort of getting involved in, in, a, in a battle. Maybe we can get up there! Of some kind. Because it's all quite, like, quiet um, after this scene. Which is kind of like a letdown. 
Okay. Now where? Incredibly lucky that this walker just happens to be covered in vines in all the right spots. It's incredibly lucky. Let's climb to the top. I do wonder, like, what rebel soldier is. Was, like, there was one guy taking shots at me then, I don't know from where. All I could see was like blue laser fire hitting me. This is not going well. Uh, well, uh, I wouldn't like to have been those guys. That looks like a terrible way to go. Reading a new ship on scanners. They brought more firepower than we thought. How's our hull looking? Badly damaged. We're at 70% integrity and falling. That should still be enough to stop out these insurgents. Huh? <laughs> it actually worked. Okay, uh, throttle. Report, what's happening over there? You're in violation of Imperial Protocol. Shut that guy up. Two zero seven. Stand down or we won't have... Better. <laughs> Let's do this. That's the blasters. Whoops. That's out of the way. Someone who just brought an ad to the table. Who are you? Someone making the Empire angry. <laughs> We're advancing on an imp landing pad up ahead. I wouldn't mind fire support. Copy that. Let's make them even angrier. All right. Hey, you see that vehicle quite a bit on uh, Star Wars Rebels, but you don't tend to see it anywhere else. Yeah, and there we go. We've met Saw Guerrero. Unfortunately, that is like this cool sequence, um, Saw Guerrero. Uh, well, well, the entire time you're on the sheet this time around is one of the few sort of um, references to the wider Star Wars universe that the game actually has. Took out the Which bridge. is a shame. I'm sure there are other characters in the canon they could have used. But... There's the 
landing pad. But again, I think it's the uh, Lucas film story. Uh, right, sort of. You know, Got to take them uh, out. Keep, uh, keep an eye on the timeline, try not to make it too complicated or whatever. Or try not to have this sort of interact too much with the timeline. He's headed for us. Can you do anything? Yeah, I'm okay. You all right? No, we are not doing that again. <laughs> you just wrecked a perfectly good walker. Got a name? Cal Kestis. So Guerrero. What are you doing on Kashyyyk? Looking for somebody. What are you doing here? My companions and I came to Kashyyyk to disrupt and pill supply lines. Hey! Who are you looking for? A Wookiee chieftain named Tarful. Tarful is impossible to find. There's a reason he's evaded the Empire for this long. He's a freedom fighter? He's THE freedom fighter. A symbol of the Wookiee resistance. Striking at the Empire from the Shadowlands. Huh. Seer, Grease, this is Saw. How you doing? What do you want with Tarful? Jedi business. Jedi are dead. Not all of them. Get that over corpse? The master gave it to me. This pad supports an imperial refinery that runs on Wookiee slave labor. Intel suggests that some of the captains there are guerrilla fighters. I should help them. One of them might know how to contact Tarful. It's possible. Oh, wait a minute, hold on, wait a minute. The Manus works wonders. I mean, it's a great ship, excellent pilot, but it is not built for close support. We'll stay here and monitor Imperial transmissions. With a bit of luck, we'll intercept any distress calls. Appreciate it. My lieutenants and I will scout ahead to prepare the attack. Join us when you're ready. Go! Go! Surprisingly, they have got quite a lot of mileage from Saul Guerrero, considering he was uh, just like a, a side character, sort of, in The Clone Wars for a few episodes. I think. It's been a while since I've watched The Clone Wars. But, yeah, he's been in, like, what, Rogue One? Uh, Rebels? This? Probably gonna be in some more things down further on down the line. He might appear in the next one, if they make a sequel to this. So, yeah, I mean, they got, like, got a lot of mileage. And I think that's actually... Well, no, I'm, I'm almost positive that is uh, Forrest Whitaker doing the voice and possible motion capture as well. So that's cool. Glad you're all right. Yeah, yeah, good to see you too. This place is a dump. Your plan worked. And now you want to follow Saul? What do you think of Saul's plan? He's fighting a losing battle. I doubt freedom for the Wookiees is his only goal. He seems trustworthy. He might prove to be. But there's more going on here than we know. And don't forget the Empire fights dirty. Watch your tail in that refinery, kid. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Have either of you heard of the Parsons? Rumors and cantinas, but not much to go on. They call them radicals. Yeah, I heard the Empire's got bounties on their heads. You go to cantinas? Jedi aren't easy to find. We needed news. 
And drinks. <laughs> anyway, that's a story for another time. <laughs> okay, then. Uh, yeah, also, in regards to Sol Guerrero, I think this is the earliest appearance of him after the Clone Wars animated series. I think it goes, probably goes straight from like Clone Wars and then into this. So that's cool. Things are even worse here than on Zepho. I'll check it out. That's a gonk droid. Hey. Find something? Did you say Zepho? I used to live there before the Empire came. Do you know it? Yeah, I've been. It's horrible what happened. We weren't able to fight back. But here, with the Wookiees, we have a chance. Thank you for standing with us. It's good to have a Jedi on our side. Uh, Jedi. If anything goes wrong with this plan, we're finished. Mari's mapped out the nearest garrisons. The Empire won't have time to send reinforcements. We'll be okay. If we can do it quick. Saw's seen us through worse. I've got nothing but respect for that man, but this isn't a forest skirmish. I hope we're ready. Mm. All right. Yeah, this is like this kind of feels more Star Warsy <coughs> than most things in the game. Oh, uh, what you doing? It's kind of like a welcome change from just uh, climbing around uh, excavation sites and whatnot to actually uh, fight in a battle, sort of. But even then, uh, for the actual battle, should be at the we're end of kind of just relegated to the side. Like the battle's happening somewhere else, and we're just going along the sort of side passages and whatnot. Let's check out the bench over there. Could be something useful. All right, I need to avoid that web. How much current can you conduct? Well, with this transformer, I bet you can short circuit Imperial tech. Okay, BD1? Hey there, BD1. No, wait, do it again, do it again, do it again. Ah, son of a... Nope, I am avoiding the web. For anyone who is unaware, you go to the web and basically a... Uh, uh, some kind of... Spider thing jumps out at you. Okay, then move this over here. There, stop it. That does the trick. Oh no way! I can't do that anyway. Can I? Damn it! Can't go up. Fair enough. Fair enough. That's for a uh, a later return, I guess. Ah, damn it. Damn it on multiple levels. Let's get back on track. Towards the Imperial Refinery.
Imperial Sap Refinery lies dead ahead. What does the Empire want with tree sap? Nothing good. They refine the sap into a powerful compound, and they're rushing to expand production. We have to stop them. That's the plan. We don't know they're in game, but they spread themselves too thin. This map we recovered proves it. Here you go, bud. These refineries double as brutal prison camps. We use those cutters to create a distraction while you take your lightsaber and free the Wookiees inside. You need their help to stop the Empire. Understood. Watch yourself in there. You hear that? Sidney needs my help. Come on, buddy. Yeah, so they're just going to go more towards the uh, direct route and start a gunfight, and I'm just going to go around the long way. The long and, by comparison, boring way. Alright, to be fair, that doesn't look like much of a gunfight, does it? Just got that one guy shooting, and then one guy on the other side shooting back. Alright, let me buy something. Okay, what to get though? Uh, health. Health will come in handy, I think. Cannon? All right. Stormtrooper Commander. Wookiee warriors left this. They use this place as a hideout in their battle against the Empire. Wow. Yeah, that caused some damage. It is kind of cool that things are happening in the background, like you see little stormtroopers running around over there. Is probably the coolest thing I have done in this game consecutively, taking out three of those. <coughs> I, I got it. Let's take him on. All right, now that was amazing. If I uh, do say so myself. And this droid looks like he's probably shitting himself. Watch out! Me up! Stop! Stop! A Jedi. This is what I've trained for. Okay, this might not be as impressive. I'm feeling the pressure. Fuck you! Traitor! Jedi will perish. 
Taking Jedi. I won't bow to you. We've got them on the run. Keep pushing. Looks like you're blocked. I'll fix that. Never seen a trooper like that before. You gotta get these Wookiees out of lockup. Keep moving, Jedi. Vents open. Yeah, I think Purge Troopers, I haven't read any of the new Star Wars comics, but I think the Purge Troopers are kind of just in this game, maybe? I haven't seen them in anything else, uh, but I'm not ruling out the, they they probably a comic book somewhere, like a new Marvel Disney comic book. New, yeah, Marvel does Star Wars now, doesn't it? Yeah. Of course it does, it's talked by Disney, we on about it. Yeah, the new mix of Star Wars comic book. They're probably introduced in that. Tight fit, huh, BD? Flame beetles, they're coming through the wall! Hit our nest! I can't fight anymore! Jedi, engage with caution! Wolf <laughs> squad is down! Ah, oh, for God's sake. Alright. Huh? Nice job. The flame beetle. Yeah, the old bastards, the ones that blow up. What kind of evolution is that? I wonder. Sure you want to plug into One this where thing? <coughs> okay. you just spontaneously combust when you die. Oh, a shortcut! That's why you wanted to move this thing. You had no idea that was there, did you? You just wanted to turn that cutter on. Look at that, I got another skill point. Nice. And yeah, now what to get? I'll probably get one of these. Empowered slow or enhanced force recovery. Or just greater force attunement. I go for that one. Oh, damn it. Nope, 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 nope. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, okay. What did I get? Oh, yeah, don't like these things. Oh, God. No, oh, God. Stim! How do I get out of here? God, I hate these spiders so much. Oh, come on! Come on, get out, get away, get away. Oh, yeah, I hate those things. They're the Empire's problem now. At least we have the high ground. <laughs> like, I always just assumed that high ground thing was like a lie, because people have, like, you know, there's, oh god, there's like so many things online about it now, but I always just assumed that was just, like, Obi-Wan trying to, uh, like, you know, um, taunt Anakin, more or less, into sort of doing, you know, making a mistake into sort of jumping up, because he knew he would be able to take him out. Uh, that, that is my theory, anyway. 
Well, anyway, um, I'm actually going to call it quits here. Um, right, so that's been the Battle of Kashyyyk. Uh, not much of a battle, admittedly, but still a battle nonetheless. If you guys could leave a like, comment, and subscribe, that would be amazing. And if you wait around for the end screen, you will get uh, two suggestions for stuff on my channel that you might like, to some degree or another. For now, though, that's it. So until the next time, do look after yourself, do take care, and, uh, well, see you then. Ta-da.